Ja. Øh... You know, uh, when when people they compare between uh, uh, between Jesus and Adam using a verse in the Bible, uh, the Bible never said that Jesus is Adam. Uh, the The Bible always is speaking to us about in a parable way, like uh, like uh, what was the purpose of the first person? What is the purpose of the second person? Uh, and you know, if you are a person when a I try to make a story out of nothing, then the story will be uh, in different uh, in different direction. Uh, Adam, as a man, uh, he is created from dust, and to dust he go. The Messiah, he is not created from dust, and he did not go to the dust. He is from above, as he said, I'm from above, you are from below. Uh, uh, the the coming of the Messiah in the image of Adam, uh, which means like the flesh of an Adam, which is a dust, you know, a creation, a dust of uh, a dirt. So when God He humbled Himself, He took the image of a man. He took the image of Adam. In fact, the Bible says God created Adam in His image. So, uh, but that does not make Jesus. The same as Adam, even if the Bible there is a verse uh, mentioning something close to that. Uh, and Eve is not uh, God, uh, and neither Mary is God. So I don't know, people they have a weird understanding of things when the Bible is so clear. There's, and you know, remember, the Bible is not only one verse, uh, it's a book. If it's a verse, and then we can make from this verse different story. But we have to understand the whole book, and then we can come with the meaning of that verse. In fact, we have to read even the whole chapter, not only a verse by itself. 